website called Luna Geo Dedica, and it's a fantastic tool to shoot at night to make a basic lighting and uh, it's uh, very very well designed uh, you have uh, like five one two three four five rows of light you can change a bulb it could be spot medium or flood uh, we can put gel on it so it could be tungsten or daylight or in between and it's really very useful it's powerful um, and uh, it's one of the light type, you know, I, I use it for every, sh every setup we had at night and uh, it covers a, a great area. Um, the, the concept of it is uh, also, it's, it's so well designed that the wind has no effect on it. You can, I mean, we experimented it with, uh, with uh, quite strong wind and uh, the light was not even moving. So, uh, I mean, it's like a Ferrari of the light. <laughs> So I've been working for many, many, many years with uh, iridite lighting fixtures, specifically the aircraft lights that are fantastic. Uh, fantastic, the only tool that you really can make sun with, uh, solve a lot of problems, you can stay away from the sets and still get light in. But uh, once, about five, six years ago, I was called to make a movie that was taking place in Livorno, Leghorn is a city not far from here, Harbour City. Uh, so the problem was to portray the town using the f light fixtures of the town. Problem with light fixtures of the town is that the sources are sodium vapor, you name it, they're all over the place color-wise and we like that but at the same time we needed some overall exposure to read the city in a neutral way. So the idea was to create something that would be like a huge china ball to be put in the sky. And uh, since then, they developed and made it better and better, coming to the geodesic structure that is simple, sturdy, and not only by the structure itself, it gives you the right incline for each light fixture. Uh, not only being geodesic, he is much better equipped to withstand winds, even strong gales. And, uh, Throughout the use of it, we we proven that right and feasible, and so is now they came up with the small version. The small version, I think, is even a better improvement because in this space you can have a 27 kilowatts. So in other words, these thing equal eight space lights. So you can imagine what it means in terms of making it easier to rig a stage where you need to provide a strong, even diffused light. How easier it is to put five of these instead of hundreds of space lights. Uh, you can anchor it not necessarily just over a crane, but you can, you know, if there are structures, like if you are in an industrial area, you always have find, you can always find places to hook it up there. It's fast, it's, really easy it allows you not to have anybody wasting their night over the crane so you have more hands on the ground because it's the crane itself that provides the positioning so again it's a new tool and i would really recommend you to try it so that uh, you can come up with users that we haven't thought of yet that is the great thing about new stuff